Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to our brand new FIFA 22 video. This is Leo here bringing you another special player review, another center back future stars review here on the channel today. First it was Roger Ivanez and now it is the turn of the BPL beast from Southampton named Mohamed Salisu guys. Yes, Salisu gets himself an incredible center back card and what shocks me the most is that he's under 30k man. This card a couple of years ago would easily be 100k man because you have the pace, you have the defending, you have the physical, the right height, the right work rate. This card seems to be an insane cheap defender and we're going to be testing out that theory today to see if he is definitely good and can hold up in division rivals i am in d2 i believe so it is going to be a good test to see how good salisu is he's 6-3 like a dimension medium high left footed two star three star not really relevant bought for 28,500 coins which is super cheap if you ask me and you get into the in-game stats and they look phenomenal guys they look absolutely insane first the 81 pace 80 acceleration 82 sprint speed there's only one type of chemistry that goes on this card and that is a shadow i don't have one right now but i definitely will be applying it today because i want to have that acceleration up to 90 i want to have that sprint speed up to 92 and yeah that is what you have to do guys because look at the strength and aggression you don't really need to put an anchor on this card you can if you want to but i think that would be a waste onto the passing of 60 85 short passing really really good he should be able to get um any passes you know through my opponent's pressure perfectly to my midfielder so uh that is what i'm hoping for salisu dribbling of 71 78 agility 74 balance very average when it comes to the agility and balance so his side to side movement should be pretty good reactions of 89 his ai blocking should be insane so i'm looking forward to seeing how he reacts when my opponent shoots and if he's an a block ai blocking machine Definitely, I will show you in today's review. 86 composure as well. Has pretty good composure and he is a clutch defender. And talking about defending, guys. Defending rating of 86, guys. With that shadow, it is basically 96, 97 defending. So he is definitely a big time wall. And lastly, guys, the physicality of 89. 98 strength, guys. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. If I press circle, he should be able to get the ball back. 88 aggression as well should help him out. 73 stamina. I'm not too worried about that because he does have medium high worker. He's not going to be really making runs. Player traits. He has no player traits. And that will conclude the introduction for Mohamed Salisu, the 30k defender. Is he worth the pickup? Is he not? How does he compare with other BPL center backs? A lot of questions to be answered. So let's get on to the gameplay portion of the review. Vamos, Salisu. Let's go. Get out of here. That strength, man. The strength of Salisu is going to be a game changer. Dale, vamos. Catch up. Salisu. He's going to cross it. He's going to pass it. Nice coverage right there. And great AI blocking. That is the reactions. And great standing tackle right there. Fortunate bounce. I thought they fixed that in the patch where you make a standing tackle. And it stops going to your opponent. But two great highlights right there by Salisu. If I was getting highlights, I wouldn't even care. Dale Salisu, vamos. Side to side movement, Salisu is good. Let's go. Great standing tackle. Great reaction right there. And uh, every single touch is bouncing to my opponent, man. It's getting a little bit frustrating. I don't know what's going on. Vamos, Salisu. Play the play. Perfect interception right there. Ah, the pass. But hey, another interception. Great coverage right there. I don't know what happened, man. I pressed that tackle button. And instead of tackling, he switched to Roberto Carlos. Oh, my goodness. The gameplay right now is atrocious. All right, come on. The pace test. Pace test. Salisu. Perfect, man. Dale, Salisu. Vamos. Me gusta lo que veo. Oh, my goodness. He feels so fast, guys. He feels faster than 81 pace, man. Dale. Salisu. Covering. 
Vamos, me gusta. There we go. I don't even have to press circle and he's winning the ball back. Those are the type of center backs I like. Vamos. Let's go. Oh. Perfect reactions right there. Perfect reactions right there. Unfortunate bounce back to Socrates. Perfect reaction. Ah, that's three back-to-back -back AI block. That's what I was expecting from Salisu. And I'm running out of breath. And that is what I'm getting, man. What a fantastic center back. Like I said, one of the best value for coin center backs out there at this moment. Get out of here. You're not going to do that on Salisu. Damn, calm down, Salisu. So, guys, I did something dumb. I sold Salisu before ending the review. I cannot believe what I just did. But, I mean, you saw what he did, guys. A fantastic center back. And he is definitely uh, one of the best value for coin center backs in the game. He feels so fast, man. I guess it's the body type combined with the agility and the pace, man. I did have a shadow and he was unstoppable you saw all the highlights if the ball uh was coming his way he would win it he would get his uh 89 reactions in right there get his body great ai blocking center back the strength out of this world guys interceptions was pretty good he was at the right place at the right time i do gotta attribute that to the defensive awareness and i mean only the only comp probably the 60 dribbling and 67 long passing if you wanted to put a comp but uh, yeah, composure, he has it, reactions, defending, physical pace, and body type is phenomenal, man. So, my meta rating, I'll probably give it an 8.5 out of 10. Final rating, uh, 8.5 out of 10. I think he's definitely better than, what's that center back? I forgot his name at this moment, but he was like a Europa League card. You That French Jop, I believe, he's definitely better than Jop. I know a lot of people might be asking that question, and he's definitely probably a top eight center back in the Barclays Premier League so if you are looking for a cheap beast definitely go pick up this card and I the only thing I can think of of this card being cheap is he people think he's slow with the 81 pace or it's just a nation link guy nation and uh team links they're not the best but if you run a Barclays Premier League who cares pair him up with Baran and you are good to go and that will conclude today's review. Hopefully helped you out in deciding whether you want to get this card or not. And you enjoyed this review. Before I let you guys, I want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. I have been killing it with the support. And I love seeing that, guys. So please take a second out of your day. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. And expect more reviews later on. This is Leo. I bid you goodbye. And good night.